happen? Yeah, sure. Can you do that anymore? They use the crust, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a good question. We know Chad down at Webster Pond has plenty of feed available for people. I think they usually like you to use that. Yeah, it's probably yeah. a little healthier for the birds to have a consistent diet, like it is for all of us. People. Right, sometimes they say, don't feed the birds. Yeah. Don't feed, I yeah. don't even know what the rules are anymore, but you just go with the rules there. But anyway, it is still really nice out here on the weather deck with lots of sunshine, but things are going to be changing between now and tomorrow afternoon, so let's get right to it. Here's what's new and what's next as we look ahead on our weather maps. First things first, our weather right now is great, but we are still timing out the threat for passing thunderstorms. And really, despite the gorgeous weather we have right now, between now and especially mid-afternoon tomorrow, we will have an occasional threat of thunderstorms. But we're still on course and on track for a wonderful weekend. And then we've got to monitor Monday for a new opportunity of some strong thunderstorms. So let's hit up the radar again. Here in central New York, there is nothing going on. However, between now and let's say 8, 9 o'clock, don't be surprised if something tries to form somewhere around here and then move into central New York. Now, besides that local threat, look at this. There are rounds of showers and storms. The closest is actually not that far away, just north of Kingston and Peterborough. This is likely to move across the international border and affect areas of the North Country and east of Lake Ontario. In fact, I'm actually surprised there's not a watch for this, a severe thunderstorm watch, and I wouldn't be surprised if warnings are issued due to wind damage for the North Country. We'll, of course, watch that carefully for them. And that's actually one spot highlighted as a threat for severe weather with an opportunity up north of 15 to 25 percent for wind damage. But here in central New York, we're in the lowest threat here, marginal risk, which is basically a 5 to 10 percent chance that one of those thunderstorms up north would move into our area and create damage. Again, tomorrow we have a new opportunity to pop up thunderstorms. It was kind of the reverse of what we have tonight in that the best chance for thunderstorms to have damaging wind would be likely south and east. Why? because you guys have more opportunity to get warmer. And as that front comes through later in the afternoon, that's the best chance for severe weather. Remember, when we say severe thunderstorm, we mean like damaging wind, damaging hail, something like that, not just the run of the mill thunderstorm. So anyway, as we look ahead between now and this evening, remember, we've got those thunderstorms up north we're monitoring and then possibly something that may pop up between now and nine o'clock in central New York. This is more conditional. A lot of our computer models are saying it's going to happen, so we'll throw it in there. And then, again, watch for passing showers and storms, most likely up north, and that's the best chance of anything that could be strong to severe. Then tomorrow, it's humid, a mix of sun and clouds. New front starts coming in hour by hour. Notice we're just seeing developments early afternoon in central New York. Well, the best chance of severe weather is later in the afternoon as you get into that warmer air. We'll watch it both for central New York and southeastern spots. Remember, the weekend's great, less humid, but still seasonably warm around 80 Saturday, 84 Sunday. And remember, as we look ahead, we've got new opportunities for thunderstorms Monday, and some of those could be feisty as we finish the day. Stanley Law Skywatch. 81 downtown the Adirondack Furniture Camera. We're good for now, but we'll keep an eye on that radar. And you can, too, with the CNY Central Weather Authority mobile app on your phone. So if you don't have it, download it today. Now back inside. Pete, thank you.